welcome back now in this video we will start work further right on the space screen so what I'll do first you will go up and first let me just create a welcome screen dot file and also for the home screen dot file so what I'll do in here right click on the lib and create a new directory and we will name this as a home screen right to the directory okay guys and right inside the home screen directory you will create a dar file and we will name this as a home underscore screen now in here we will have a stat for widget and we will name this as a home screen we don't need this key tell this and now in here add this library material dot down that is fine now for now in here you will remove that and we will have a scaffold right in here and we will have a app bar and app bar let's provide that right in here you will say title and write in the title that's our text widget and write in the text we will have a string and in string we will say home screen so that you guys just know that we will be on the home screen okay we are done with the home screen close that from here now come back again in here add right in the lib create a new directory name this as a welcome screen welcome screen and right inside that directory we will create a dart file and we will name this as a welcome underscore screen okay now in here you will have a stat list widget and we will name this as a welcome screen we don't need this key tell this and click in here import the library material dot dot for now in here you will have a scaffold and right in the scaffold at bar you will show that just for now later on you will modify that whenever we will start working right on the volume screen so in here what we will have title and let's have that text string we will say it's a welcome screen in here const modifier for now so we are done with the home screen and welcome screen now we will just close that from here and let's go back towards the display screen okay in here we are already on the display screen as you guys can see right in here now we will create a method in which we will set the timer okay if the user will be logged in then we will send the user right to the home screen and if the user is not logging then we will send him or her right to the welcome screen so for that we will create a method and it is going to be right on the splash screen above the widget bill okay so let's do that we are going to name this as a star okay timer because we are about to set the timer in this method okay so it's going to be there for a several few minutes then it will eventually send the user whether to the home screen or the welcome screen as I tell you now Right in this method, let's set the timer. So in here, timer. Okay. Set the duration there, and we will set it to five. Or you can change it to anything you want. I'll set it to five or four. Let's go with the five now. And in here, comma. In there, brushes, and then. Is going to be asynchronous 
in here curly braces right it and semicolon that is fine now take this down from here and now what I'll say first let me remove that error in here let's import the library that I'm okay the error is gone now as you guys can see in here also add the const modifier now right in here what I'll say we will set the if condition in which as I tell you before we will check if the user will be logged in we will send him or to the home screen and if the user is not logged in then we will send them right to the welcome screen so in here what I'll say firebase authentication firebase auth okay dot instance first let me just add the library for that wow it didn't show this occasion let's write it for now and we will check it in here we just make a spelling mistake okay in here as you guys can see firebase put e in here now now click in here and import it there we go okay with the suggestion firebase auto dot, dot and now if you write dot there we go with the suggestion instance because we are creating the instance right to the current user okay so we will say it's not equal to simply mean that if the user will be logged in okay not equal to means that if the user will be logged in then in that case what I'll do I'll simply navigate that current user okay right to the home screen so in here we will say navigator dot push replacement it's going to take the material page root you will provide that root in here now in here contacts and we will just take this down from here so that you guys can see it easily now in here let's send the user to the home screen okay I hope we will see the suggestion let me just see first we will just write it okay write it and semicolon column and click in here and remove that one s that's why we didn't see the suggestion now just add the library there we go with the suggestion home screen dot dot the error has been gone if the user will be logged in it simply means that then we will send the current user right to the home screen now right in the else if the user will be not logged in okay so in that case you will simply just copy that navigator from here to here for time saving and paste it right in the else okay and we will just change this to the welcome screen okay guys why we just let me just check the name for the welcome screen what was it it's welcome screen okay copy this from here and you can manually write in here like we did the home screen okay in here welcome screen add the library welcome screen dot dot that is fine the error has been gone as you guys can see now so we are done with the method now we have to call upon that right in the inner state so below the that method above the widget build in here let's have that inner state in here so in its state there we go and right inside that we will just call upon the start timer so it's gonna call that whenever this object is inserted right into this tree so it will call this method that we just created exactly once for each start object it creates okay so all done in here now let's just go and also we set the duration okay guys remember for five seconds now i'll just hold reload the app and let's just see for now we didn't log in okay because we didn't create the user yet there is no sign up page yet so there is no user so that gonna equals to null then it simply mean that there is no current user so if there will be no current user 
then in else we just send the user right to the welcome screen and you guys can see the output right in here okay for now right in the welcome screen we just add the app bar okay let me just show you one more time again there we go with the welcome screen app bar and you guys can see that right in here so right in the future videos whenever we will be working on the sign up screen we will register our user and then we will simply that user will be logged in we will test that right in the future videos and you guys will notice that home screen then because that current user will be not equal to null then then it will simply just get the current user to the home screen for now as I tell you before so many time that current user okay the instant that we just created firebase authentication auth okay it is basically equal that to null and if it's equal to null then you guys can see in else it send the user the current user right to the welcome screen and you guys can see the output right in here and it's working totally fine that's it for this video right in the next video we will work further so see ya